hello beautiful people welcome back to another wonderful moment with simi if you are here for the first time kindly subscribe turn on post notifications and remember to give my video a thumbs up have you done that have you thank you today i am going to be teaching you all how to set up and disassemble a ring light i got gifted a ring light by my brother earlier this week i think on monday yes on monday i got gifted a ring light by my brother he paid for the ring light to be delivered to me and i was really really happy i am still really really happy because what cheers to clara youtube video okay, i'm happy because i'll be able to give you guys clara videos i pray so and i pray you know nepa does not disappoint me yes because i'll have to actually get a power bank it's it can be plugged directly to light and also to a power bank I, initially i didn't know how to set up a ring light but when i i remember going to a friend's place and a ring light was delivered to her and i happened to be at home at, in a house that day so we had to use our initiatives to bring the different parts of the ring lights together so when i got mine on monday i was able to use that same initiative to like bring the different parts of my ring light together and i got it perfectly and i was like why not teach you guys also how to do the same thing i'm going to be unboxing the ring light i got on monday I am not just unboxing this thing for the first time. I already opened it and tested it as the Nigerian girl that I am. But for the sake of this video, we are unboxing. Thank you. So this ring light did not come in this nylon. I was the one who got the nylon to like package it together. I got it from an Instagram vendor and it came without nylon. Yes, it's too, it's too large. Before I could get the nylon, I would fit into it. In. It took a long time. And it was raining the day I got it delivered to me. I was I, was, I went out so I got to deliver to me where I went. I had to protect this um, ring light at all costs so it won't spoil. You have seen that this is a big reason to subscribe. I had to protect this ring light for you all. Yes, it's a 13 inches ring light. This is the tripod stand I got. This is the tripod stand I got. And this is the box of the ring light itself. I don't know if you can see it properly, but this is the box of the ring light itself. It says feel feel light and beauty face make face and eye in beauty night core extreme multiple color temperature yes this is the ring light itself um i'm going to show you where we're going to place this i really don't know what to call it i don't know what it is called and let's check the content of this tripod stand this is the tripod stand this is the tripod stand there's a way you're going to adjust it to make it longer and fit into the 13 inches that i ordered for there's something left this is the phone holder there's a way you fix this into the, the om lower part of the ring light meant to hold your phone it's flexible hey, let me adjust the camera so i'll be able to show you fully well how to set up a ring light i'll be back soon that is the lowest knob on the tripod stand Losing it to enable you stretch out the tripod stand to start with. You need to be sure that the three legs of the tripod stand are well balanced. If they are, tighten the knob properly till it is firm. There is the knob above the lowest knob on the tripod stand. Losing that knob to enable you stretch out the tripod stand to increase the length even more. Remember to tighten the knob till it is firm. Very important. Just in case you want the full length, you can go back to the lowest knob on the tripod stand, losing it and further stretch the tripod stand to get the full length.
there you go. Do not forget to tighten the knob properly till it is firm when you are satisfied with the full length. This is another part of the ring light that is to be attached next. There is a little cover on the top of the tripod stand. Gently take off this cover. You have to attach the top of the tripod stand to this hole. Gently turn it until it is firm. There you go. There is a knob attached to this part of the ring light where the ball head is. Once you loosen the knob, it will enable you to rotate or bend. Next is the ring light itself. It has a USB cord and the remotes attached to it. You will attach the screw on the top of the stand at the moment into that hole. Gently turn the ring light to fix it in. Make sure you are holding the ring light firmly so it doesn't fall. When it is firm, that is it. This is the remote control attached to the ring light. For the remote control to function, you need to plug in the USB cord. Now that the remote control is switched on, you can now put on the ring light or use the other buttons on the remote. This is the phone holder. It helps hold your phone while you take pictures or shoot videos with the ring lights. You will fix this right into the hole on the lower part of the ring light. Gently turn it until it is firm. This phone holder is flexible and can be bent. I am sorry I did not illustrate how to attach your phone to this phone holder. This is exactly where your phone is supposed to stay. Now let's switch on the ring lights. Okay. So I reduce the brightness using the remote control. I will definitely teach that before the end of this video. You can see this particular ring light has three different colors. Remember, the part that connects the tripod stand to the ring light has a ball head. This means the ring light can be rotated or even bent. This helps for product photography or flexible video recording or even image capturing. so beautiful but really i am so pretty take a look at that dimple i am alternating between the different colors the ring light has looking closely you can see it has orange white and blue before i teach you all how to disassemble the ring light let's learn a few things Okay guys, so I switched up the light and I put down the curtain so you'll be able to see the difference between when there's a ring light on and when there is no ring light on. Oh, are you ready? Are you ready? Ooh. Mm -hmm. 
And the thing about ring lights is to bring out every detail. Like it's, it's it really helps. It makes a difference. Like I showed you earlier, this is the remote and it has the the power button. The power button is the first one, then followed by the reduction button when you want to reduce the brightness. The alternate button where you can switch between the different colors that the ring light has, and then the last one is the um, increase button in case you want to increase the brightness of the ring light. So I'm just going to be testing all of this so I can switch it off with the first button, switch it back on. Then let's say I want, I want to reduce the brightness. I've reduced the brightness to increase it back and alternate between light. This is the blue, this is the orange, and this is the white. To disassemble the ring light, start by removing the phone holder. Pardon me for removing the ring light itself first. After removing the phone holder, turn the ring light gently until it comes off. Remember to hold it firmly while doing so. That is it. It's off. Next, you remove the part that connects the tripod stand to the ring lights by gently turning it till it's off. There you go. Losing the top knob on the tripod stand and let down the part of the stand that was earlier stretched out. Remember to tighten the knob when you're done. Now to the lowest knob on the tripod stand. Losing it, pull down the top and put the three legs of the stand together. Remember to tighten the knob once the three legs are back together. And that's it, we're done. I really hope you enjoy watching this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're still watching up to this moment, I appreciate you. Thank you so much. Kindly subscribe, turn on post notifications, and you know, drop comments below. Let me know the kind of content you want to see. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and you know, Stay tuned, don't go anywhere. I'll be back next week with another wonderful video. Bye! It's just